fast food commercials are like a peek into an alternate dimension, where everyone is happy and healthy and thrilled to be digging into that absolutely picture-perfect delicious hamburger. And then there's reality, where you actually get fast food and spend the rest of the day questioning your life decisions. So why does real fast food look so much worse than advertised? Here are some sneaky reasons fast food always looks better in the commercials. Bogus breakfast. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day, but it rarely looks or tastes as good in real life as those ads would have you believe. Why? Well, the reason that bacon looks so amazing on TV is because food stylists weave it over and under tubes before putting it in the oven, giving it a perfect ribbon effect you'll never get actually frying bacon. At least it's edible, though. Unlike advertisement pancakes, the flapjacks in your photo shoot are likely sprayed with Scotchgard to keep the fake syrup from seeping in. And that syrup is actually made from motor oil in order to get a deeper, richer color. Yuck. Bad burgers. If you think breakfasts are bogus, wait until you find out how they make burgers look so good. Firstly, the meat is deliberately undercooked to make the burger look juicier and plumper. Then fake grill marks are added either by burning the meat with an electric charcoal starter or by simply drying it on with eyeliner. Then the burger is touched up with shoe polish to make sure it looks perfect. Next, the burger is placed on a special bun that has been meticulously picked from hundreds of buns to make sure it has just the right look. It certainly is a big bun. It's a very big bun. Big fluffy bun. It's a very big fluffy bun. Once that is done, produce is added, only it's been sprayed with hairspray so it looks fresh. And finally, just to make sure the burger holds together, stylists add cardboard and pins. So go ahead and chow down. Fried Chicken Fakery Chicken pieces, like any meat, come with their own imperfections and irregularities. But in the ads, chicken always looks so perfectly hot and juicy. How? Two tricks. First, the chicken is injected with mashed potatoes to make it plump. And then steam is added by microwaving water-soaked cotton balls and hiding them behind the meat. Feels like my tummy's just asking for some Kentucky Fried Chicken. A side order of lies. What meal is complete without a side order of wax and a big cup of antacids? That's basically what you get in the advertisements as food stylists use wax to make sauces stay cohesive during long photo shoots. And the fizz in those insanely fizzy drinks is produced by dropping some antacid down in there. Hey, if you actually ate any of this stuff, you'd need some antacid too. Dessert Deception If you tasted the frozen treats in a fast food ad, you'd be in for quite a shock. Instead of delicious ice cream, you might get a mouthful of mashed potatoes, vegetable shortening, and powdered sugar. And instead of a creamy milkshake, you could be sipping on shortening, powdered sugar, and jello. And that whipped topping? Probably shaving cream. These stand-ins don't melt like the real thing, so they're preferable under the hot lights of a shoot. Where am I? Humans require ice cream. What is this place? Eat the ice cream. High-tech hijinks. Even after all that meticulous prep and expert placement of ingredients, you better believe the final image still gets photoshopped. Just like human models, burger models get the once-over to remove blemishes, fix any imperfections, and enhance coloring. And the use of technology extends even further, as Tech Insider revealed that special robots are used to create those goofy, food-flying-everywhere commercials. Fast food. Great for robots, dangerous for everyone else. <laughs>